Mock exam one, problem three. It's about a box plot. In total, we have got three regions. And the first question, it is asked, which box plot uh, is the most skewed? If you want to look at whether the box plot is skewed, you need to compare the A part and the B part. If this data, if A equals B, then we say it's a symmetric distribution. But if A and B is quite different, differs too much, then our data tends to skew to the longer part. So this is very skewed. And we call, if it is skewed to your right, then that will be positive skewed. Now let's look at this question. You have got three regions, two, three, and four. And the first box plot is something like this. And the second box plot is a little bit symmetric. And the fourth box the, uh, in region four is somewhere here. So you can find that in the first category, in the first region, A and B differs the most. So this is the most skewed uh, region. And the second question asks about you 25% uh, of the salaries are higher than what? And it is in region uh, 3. 25% of your data is lower than this number, Q1, while 75% is lower than Q3. And if 75% of the data is lower than Q3, this also means 25% of your data is higher than Q3. So you only need to find what is your Q3 for region 3. And that will be around 105,000 dollars. Don't forget the units. The third question asks, asks you about uh, which measure of dispersion are shown by the box plot. If it is about dispersion from the box plot, you can find uh, the range. You can also find uh, the interquartile range. The range means the highest number minus the lowest number. And in this case, that should be uh, $65,000. And the interquartile range means the third quarter minus the first quarter. So this is your first quarter, this is your third quarter, and it is about range four. And you can find a uh, third quarter is around 90,000. The first quarter is around 70,000. So the interquarter range is 90,000 minus by 70,000. So it is around $20,000.